The Descendant is reportedly a story about a strange father who reconnects with his daughters and stuff happens. I could tell you that George Clooney is on form in this movie. I could tell you that the director just rocks in this movie and the cinematography is absolutely fantastic because all of that is true. But I think that there's something deeper going on in the story. The first is about how do we deal with loss, whether it's anticipated loss or unexpected. In this movie there are many characters who just are in denial refusing to accept that the that loss is inevitable. And then there's George Clooney's character, Matt, who is of the opinion that uh, we just need to get past this. There's a brighter future ahead. Uh, we just need to move on. He realizes that there, there's baggage that needs to be dealt with. I feel that that's quite true. It's certainly true of myself and maybe you too. It's that, you know, we're wanting to move past the difficult bit, to get onto the brighter. Uh, future, but there is always stuff that needs to be dealt with. Which brings me nicely to my second point, because life is messy, and how do we choose to deal with that? Clooney's character has many different issues that need to be faced and resolved in this movie. First, there's the relationship with his daughters, there is um, echoes of the past, and then there is unresolved issues with his wife. But he takes each moment as it comes and he lets his heart and his conscience guide him quite clearly. And I feel that that should be the same for us because at the end of the day we need to be able to sleep at night. We need to be comfortable with the decisions that we've, been, that we've made. The roles that we have and our responsibilities change and morph as our life progresses and how we deal with that says more about us as people than anything else. Take Alex, for example, in the movie. She's um, at school, she's away from home, she's uh, under the influence of alcohol and drugs and poor friendship choices, but then she gets dragged back into the family situation such as it is, and how she reacts to her changing roles and the responsibilities that she has matures her as a person. She sees herself finally as some sort of force for good. So if you haven't seen it, it's worth seeing. I loved it. I'll catch you tomorrow.